Okay, in the last step, um, you went in and you picked the material. You listed that it was uh, picked and, and that it's ready for outbound delivery. Now we're going to go back into the system and post the goods issue. Uh, and what we're doing now with posting of the goods issue is we're finally changing the database to let the database know this material is no longer on the shelf. Everything is, is, is moved out of there. Uh, so that we can keep track of our inventory so that it moves in the right direction. So what we're going to do, I'm on page 38 of the PDF. Uh, same as before, we're going logistics, sales and distribution, into shipping and transportation, outbound delivery. Now we're going to change, and we're changing a single document again. Double left click on single document. It should bring up your outbound delivery that you've been working with before. So if it doesn't, click on the uh, search button here, go in, follow the instructions on the middle of page 38 so that you can find the, the information. However, once you get in your delivery, what you need to do is you need to go up to the post goods issue icon, left click it, You could see from my computer there where the little dots started flowing across the screen um, that there was an internet connection um, error and so that internet connection uh, did does look like it saved my post goods issue because when you clicked on post goods issue um, you should have seen a little pop up in the bottom saying that it was saved however whenever I just clicked my uh, post goods issue it says it's already been scheduled for delivery but uh, that's all there was to do with this step, so you should be ready to move forward.